Two Fish Talks. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Two Fish Talks. I'm Miss Brooke. Here's Ruff. <laughs> We're here today to read with you in our one-year Bible. Let's go. February 18th, the river that turned to blood. Moses and Aaron were having a lot of trouble. The Lord had commanded them to take his people from Egypt. But when Moses and Aaron talked to Pharaoh, he refused to let the Israelites go. He made the Israelite slaves work harder. Now the Israelites were too discouraged to listen to Moses and Aaron. So the Lord told Moses and Aaron to go back to Pharaoh. When Moses and Aaron went to see Pharaoh, he demanded a miracle. So Aaron threw down his shepherd's rod and it became a snake. But Pharaoh brought in his magicians and they did the same thing. Aaron's snakes swallowed theirs, but Pharaoh still was not impressed. His heart was hard. So he refused to let the Israelites go. Go back to Pharaoh again in the morning, the Lord told Moses and Aaron. Meet him by the Nile River. Tell him that I demand that he let the Israelite slaves go. Tell him that the Nile River will turn to blood when you, Moses, hit it with your rod. When Aaron points his rod toward the other waters of Egypt, they will turn to blood too. Moses and Aaron did what the Lord said. When they did, the water all over Egypt turned to blood. Fish died, and there was a terrible smell. But Pharaoh's Egyptian magicians also turned water into blood. So Pharaoh remained as stubborn and hard-hearted as he had been before. He would not listen to Moses and Aaron. Pharaoh went back home to his palace. The Egyptians had to dig wells to get water. But still the Israelites remained slaves. Still they worked hard under the hot sun. They were not free yet. Wow. We'll read more tomorrow in our one-year Bible, okay? See you then. Bye-bye. <laughs>